It never matters. No, nothing matters. Welcome to another exciting, invigorating recording session of Barnyard. Be- beautiful people. Welcome to another episode of How Do Controls Work? Welcome to another episode of The Torment of Brother Elijah. The Lament of Papa Squirt. Welcome to another episode of How exactly is does this game supposed to end? Like, I, I don't see a trajectory of, okay, it's probably going to end when this happens. It ends, it ends when Otis murders his dad. Oh yeah, okay. And gets caught by Papa Squirt. And the reason Papa Squirt doesn't exist in the show is because Otis kills him to cover it up. Oops. So it's like one of those things where like the main character dies at the end, like L.A. Noir or something. Mm. Oh, oops, spoilers for L.A. Noir. That game's like, what, like eight years old now? When did L.A. Noir come out, 2011? Yeah, something like that. It's too late to come through, sun's going down, I can meet, I can meet Peck. Yeah, go, go meet the, the big rooster. Nah, that's, I don't even know what that rooster's name is. What? Oh, the... The, the big rooster. Oh, the big one, yeah. I forgot there was a big one. Oh, Peg murdered the weird cannibal. Yeah. The ferret. I don't, I don't he's like not this. a cannibal, he's just a carnivore. Yeah. You gotta help me. They're trying to make something so bad. Oh, what you need? Freddy has been having the most terrible dreams. What is his dreams? Will they become nightmares? He's or talking and is sleeping. It does not sound good. What does it sound like? Is he having like a donkey dream? I'm scared of what might happen if I wake him up. Then don't wake him up. Oh, is he sleeping right now? I thought he was looking under the coop. I don't know. Wake, wake him up inside. Save can't him wake pick. up. Could you do it? I guess. You want him to squirt him? That's what everybody wants. Watch and learn. Yeah, you're going to squirt him to death. Okay. You're going to drown him in a sleep What? What what does squirting the raccoons have to do with anything this about doesn't... waking up the ferret? What's his name? I don't even know his name. Was it Eddie? Freddy. 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 Freddy oh, the man. ferret. These five nights will never be over. No, the five nights will not end. Literally, actually. It's, it's oh. been like, what, four years? Since it's been a thing? Since Five Nights at Freddy's. It's been longer than that, but you're probably right. I don't know, it feels like an eternity. Oh, God. Okay? What? Am I dreaming? Well, I look drunk there for a second. What's going on? Why is the... Why, uh, the, why have I been dragged to hell? Oh, my God. Yeah. Whoa, you heard that? Yeah. That... What is happening? What is this game? This is spooky as crap. We say this every time, it, but what the F is this game? Okay, so I wasn't reading any of the... Oh, am I saving... The... What? What? Oh, let... Drop that baby chick. You devil dick. I don't know. You double dick. Oh, devil dick. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so... I gotta... <laughs> Did he... Did this he bring really, me into his dream world? I guess, like, so... This... How oh, is no, it? Like, we've played no, this no. how long now? I and the game... The game still manages to just take us for a ride and just, like, just take us off guard. I'll, I'll give it that. It's kind of varied in his randomness. Like, this literally, like, the... the like, oh, the sky what? literally what? looks like a freaking level from Doom or something. Okay, so not only I have to squirt the chickens yeah, out of their gotta, hands. You gotta, you gotta save them. Sometimes, because sometimes they're not there. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta throw, them, throw them back. This is strange. Strange this is, isn't strange. But, this is like a nightmare sequence from Batman Arkham Asylum with like the scarecrow. Like, did you notice that the chicks aren't even like baby chicks, they're like little chickens. Like like uh, yeah. corn, like Cornish hens. Yeah, like it Oh my god. Yeah, see? I don't, what? And who's who's supposed to be um who's supposed to be the leaderboard uh leader on this? Cause who else is being dragged into 
Sid's dreams. I know it's not about Sid. <laughs> no, that's basically what he is. Real so, Sid from what? Uh, what is what is Sid? From? Isn't Sid from uh, Ice Age? Oh yeah, the sloth. Yeah. Oh my god, I used to work with a guy that looked just like that, <laughs> and everybody used to tell him that, and I was like, oh, that's really mean, and he's like, oh, it's okay. But, it was, like, so he'd, like, do a pose and, like, do his, like, put his, like, front teeth out and stuff. Why'd you do this? I'm like, why would you do this to yourself? Like, oh, no, all the chickens. Hurry I'm, up, the chicks. I only got five left. Did he have a chicken? The chickens, Jenna. You gotta save the chickens. She will eat the chickens. She, she wouldn't want to know what to do with the chicken. My dog's stupid. Little chicks. <laughs> She's she kind of dumb, so I don't know. This is the weirdest level. It is. I don't even, I don't even Why is there no music? This is like a creepypasta. Yo. Welcome to the creepypasta level of Barnyard. If you have your copy of Barnyard with the name Ben written on it, let us know down in the comments. Ben drowned. Yeah. I, I did really well, apparently. Extremely well. Bessie's the best in the nightmare sequence. She would be. She's a living nightmare. Yeah. Ah, uh, honey. Oh, my oh God. child. <laughs> that's that's her character. That's uh, uh, honey. Bessie, yeah. Bessie the black child. lady cow. That's that, that. You saw her. You heard her. This game's racist. Calling black ladies cow. Lifesaver. Well, there's also a white lady cow and a white guy cow. Shh. There's also men cows and girl cows and men bulls, and who knows if there's girl, girl bulls. Yeah, I was asking about that. I, I was, was having a real. Were nightmare. you so so strong that you dragged me into it into your nightmare scheme? Yeah, that's that's weird. That really was like creepy pasta levels. There was like no music, nothing, just just him. Did you hear him talking? Yeah, just like there was like weird backwards talk and like he was like turning into that Satan. I don't know, I feel like an old ferret. Okay. See ya! Alright. You know the reason he's so messed up is probably because he doesn't eat meat. Exactly. That, like, because he's supposed to. He's fighting his natural urges. That's, I mean, I guess ferrets eat chickens. I don't know, actually. Like, that's that's my whole thing, is like... Hmm. Right. I've had arguments with vegans before. Alright. Oh, Idiots. really? Yeah. Yeah, to do tell. So this... I want to hear this. This lady yeah, was lady. like a uh, real hippie. Oh, real hippie dippy lady. And uh, she was bit. she was like one of those people. Like, okay, like, like we don't... Here at the Wheel Game for Bacon, we don't care what you think, what you believe, whatever. It doesn't matter. Because you're just watching our stuff and we appreciate it. But she's like one of those kinds of people that... Like, <laughs> but vegans F you. <laughs> but yeah, but this vegans about to F happen. you. But, but, but the thing is... She's like one, she's Sick. like she's a vegan and she's one of those people that's got to be like in your face with everything she is. She's like, "Oh, I'm a vegan and I'm an atheist and I'm a feminist and I'm an anemone. I'm an anemone in a woman's body and like stuff like that." Okay. Uh, how do you know this? What you work with her? Uh no, I I used to see her a lot while I uh, I used to go to this coffee shop in the mall when I worked at Chick-fil-A called uh, Rena Marie's. I knew the owners. They were really cool people. So I'd go, I'd go sit in there, like, before I had a car, and I'd just wait for my ride. Mm -hmm. And, um, so I'd go chill in there, uh, grab a, my, uh, grab my, uh, special signature drink that the owner would Jesus. always make for me. Oh, Jesus. What? I, I forgot how to jump. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were, like, making fun of me, like, no, like, you're like, I, I forgot how to jump. <laughs> What's your signature uh, drink so, at Tina Marie's or whatever? It's, uh, it's a chocolate pumpkin fra frappuccino. Well, what? Basically, I don't know. I'm a white girl. I'm sorry. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Chocolate pumpkin spice. Yes, it was, del it was delicious. Anyway, sounds alright. Anyway, so like I didn't like have like an argument argument with this with this person, but she was sitting there, and I think she might have been working there part time because I don't remember the well, owners being there. Right now. Yeah. Anyways. So, like, she was just, like, it's, like, people that do CrossFit. Like, they just can't help but talk about it. 
Because we weren't even talking about her being a vegan. She was, like, sitting there eating some weird, gross lunch. Like, it was just... <laughs> like, literally, she had, like, a uh, like a Tupperware container, and everything inside of it was, like, green or brown. It was a thick glob of avocado spread on top of a thick-ass piece of wheat bread. Honey oat, nine grain. Well, they can't have... Ultra flax. It ha- it'd have to be bread with, that's, like, made without milk. That's fine. You can find that. Like, it'd, it'd be... So I can buy... It'd have to be some gross bread. A rotating dartboard, which I probably still can't play, and a whack a rag That'd be all the fun and games. That's a thousand yeah. song. Let's see what else we got. Anyway, so... It doesn't even come up naturally. She's just like, oh, I'm a vegan and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, that's nice. And, she, and I'm like, what? Uh, so, I, like, I get curious. I'm like, so what yes. made you decide to be a vegan? Yes. And she's like... I can get the polished dance floor. <gasps> Yes, I can't. Yeah. I can't get the neon, but oh, I can get, get the polish. Yeah, I'm getting it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get it all polished for yeah. you, stranger. Yeah, that sounds no. Yo, oh, yeah. Mm. Get it all nice and polished, all glistening and ish. Wow. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> wow. What were we talking about? You were talking about some weird vegan. Yeah, yeah, person, vegans. And you yeah. guys to like some weird. So she's. Thing. So she's like. She's like, oh yeah, I'm a vegan and blah blah blah. I'm like, oh that's nice. I'm like, so what made you want to be a vegan? And she's like, well, I just like animals. They're my friends, and I don't want to eat them and blah blah blah. And she's like, well, meat's actually bad for you and blah blah blah. And I'm like, um, no. And I'm an animals. And, and I'm just like, no. And she's just like, eating meat's not natural and it's not good for you. And you know, and she's like, talking about like weirdish, like making a tiger eat salads or something dumb. Oh, wow. And I'm just like. I'm, and I'm just like, okay, I'm like, okay, so, I'm like, so, so, you, you believe in evolution, right? And she, she's like, well, yeah, and I'm like, so, so, you would say, you'd call yourself a Darwinist, and she's like, I guess so, I'm like, you know, one of the most, like, basic, fundamental, you know, building blocks to that whole, like, if you want to call it belief system, or the fundamentals of evolution is survival of the fittest, big fish eats little fish, big animal the eats funda- little animal. Yeah, yeah the fundamentals of, uh- of life, CQ, the circle of life. CQC. Yeah, it's yeah, CQC. <laughs> but yeah, just the fundamentals of the planet Earth. Big things eat little things. Even plants eat animals. Like some of, the, like some Venus flytraps actually will eat small animals, like rats and stuff. Mm-hmm. Like, and they'll, they'll they'll eat small mammals. So it's like, yeah, even plants eat meat. You dumb. <laughs> like that's just my thing. It's like I. I and she'd be like, yeah, but no. She's like, yeah, but no. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> yeah, but shut up. Yeah, but no. she's like, uh, uh. like flat earthers, like, like you, can, like you give somebody a mound of them, and it's like, yeah, the Earth's round. It's been proven, like hundreds of thousands of times. You know, even the Bible says the the Earth is round. Um, oh yeah. You know. Oh. Like, the Bible literally says, you know, like, it, somebody, here. somebody, Stop it. I'm sorry, I'm yelling, I'm yelling at my stupid fingers for pressing dumb buttons. Oh, I thought you were, like, yelling at me. I'm no. Like, <laughs> so, like, some of the flat earthers are like, well, Jesus never said the earth was brown. I'm like, do you even read? Do you even lift? Do you even lift, bro? Do you, <laughs> like, and then people are like, well, uh, flat earthers, that's, like, the b- dumbest argument ever. I'm like, just... Like, I don't, I don't oh, know how you could believe something that's so obviously wrong. I need, I need to go check, I need to go check in on. You know, because the government's lying to you. Mm-hmm. Right, Daryl? Right, of course. The government told you the earth is round, so it's gotta be a lie. I'm not saying the government always tells you the truth, but there are some things that's just like, well, this has been proven time and time again, and you could do simple experiments on your own time to prove, <laughs> you know. Hold, hold the snail up, y'all. What? Where the phone is Venom with the Captain America shield? What? Why did you move him? I don't know. I was messing with stuff. He was styling and profiling. Oh, yeah. I got the lights up. Yeah. Daryl's referring to my action figure shelf, which is yeah. a clutter crap mess right now. Yeah, got the smoothies on, on deck. You're, what the he heck? was messing with my stuff oh. one day and gave Venom Captain America shield. Okay. Alright. God, that's creepy. 
What, the staring yeah, blank the staring. Later? What the heck is this? Oh, that's the playing the music. This game is, like, uncomfortable and creepy. Like, all, like, in just baffling, just baffling. It is just... Oh, can you go dance on the dance floor, Daryl? Yeah, that's, that's a good question. Everybody's over here getting it, so let's see. Oh my god, look at that! Look at that horse... Was that the Cabbage Patch? What, this oh, over here? Oh, what, what, what's, no, that? Like, what's that? The, oh, snap! I don't know what Zach Witch called, but he's like doing the wave thing. Yeah. This cow, too. I don't know, I can't... It won't let me in. Where's my smacking butt dance that, that's in the intro? I know, right? Well, you can only do that on the flashy, you know... Colored light uh, stance for probably it's probably a mini game. Yeah. All right, got got the pinball machines. Yo, but pinball dude, machines what is if, fun as crap. What if? <laughs> what? If, yeah, what if you get the? Uh, what if you get the fancy disco dance floor, and then the game's just like hook up your DDR pad now. Yo. <laughs> Put on your cow suit. <laughs> and grab hook your up, hook up your DDR stain with foot sweat. Oh my god, ew. <laughs> what did that freak you out? Blech. Foot sweat. Did you ever have DDR pads growing up? I did, actually. See, because, man, I tell you what, there was nothing that, like, felt so gross after so many uses. <laughs> you had to clean it eventually. No, we did, but, like, I don't know, man, like, just the rubber that the bottom was made out of so it gripped to the floor, like, just... Oh, they had, they had like, that, after being in my parents' basement for a while and the humidity in it, it would that, make it, like, feel gross. Yeah, that sickening, like, sound where you pick it up off the ground. Yeah, like... Yeah. We should play DDR. That's not, that kind of sounded like a Krabby from Pokemon. <laughs> that's, what, that's what it sounds like. So, I'm re I've recently been watching the first season of Pokemon with a friend. And... It actually is kind of weird how many Pokemon actually don't even say his name sometimes. Like, Krabby doesn't say his own name. Pidgeotto doesn't say his name. Not even Pidgey, I think. They make, like, weird bird noises. Some other Pokemon that doesn't say his name. They just make noises. Thank um, you. Just, just a observation I had from watching that recently. Oh, no. I forgot to turn my phone on. No, it's not no, right. no, nobody cares. No. Um... I'm a bad person. Um, anyway, so, yeah, I watched the first season of Pokemon a few months ago. And I, I tell you what, the thing I noticed who, was... Who should I get hit on by? Ben or... Oh, that's who should I get? You should go for that, who you should, know, that who should old... Get, who should give me the you first? That old Angus, you know, go go, go for Ben. Yeah, that, that well-aged Angus. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, foot sweating uh, well-aged uh, Angus. A lot of foot, <laughs> there's a lot of foot sweat on this angus. You, you show up to go see Ben and Chris <laughs> and Chris Hansen shows up. So Brother Lives has been on a pedal kick recently. Yeah, anyways. Anyways, let me talk about Pokemon first. We'll talk about that later. Wait, are we are we done with the weird <coughs> avocado toast girl? Yeah, I'm done with that. Okay. I don't know about that. I'll I i do not feel like getting worked up. Getting uh, angry. Yeah, I, no, Ben's this way. Anyway, so so I <laughs> what I noticed about Pokemon season one was you know like how uh, '80s cartoons back in the day were a lot of times were just like 20 minute toy commercials basically, mm -hmm. like Transformers, GI Joe, and all that ish. Pokemon is like that book worse, like because <laughs> like Pokemon had like toys and video games and like all kinds of merchandise and like so basically the whole time the more I notice I'm like. I'm like, oh yeah, I remember seeing toys of that. Oh yeah, that's a game mechanic. I'm like, oh, th this is literally just a commercial for all of the merchandise. <laughs> just everything. It's like, <laughs> you know, all they needed to do at the end was like show Jeffrey the giraffe from Toys R Us come out and be like, you can buy all this stuff at Toys R Us. Well, unfortunately, Jeffrey the giraffe wasn't able to come in until Generation 3? And they had a giraffe Pokemon then? Yeah, giraffe rig. I think that's true. giraffe a rig Yeah. It sounds kind of sketchy, doesn't it? The ground is strict. Especially when you see what it looks like. Google giraffe rig. Okay. <laughs> How do you spell giraffe rig? Uh, it's giraffe, but instead of that af part, put e. <laughs> it. 
Uh, the purchase of human articles from the Gopher Underground is strictly prohibited. What? I've been doing it. You just now getting mad? Why? Why you say that though? Who? Who told you? Was the ferret? I'll ask you straight, boy. Have you been going up to Gopher Hill at night? I mean, uh, uh, oh my uh, God. Uh, yeah. What you gonna do about it? Why is it gonna get killed? It's wearing. I thought so. It looks like it's wearing like. Leggings. Uh, why does it like? Why is it wearing leggings? <laughs> you see a little hit face on this tail. Oh my god! You just noticed that? Yeah, I just noticed There's that. There's like a little face back there. That's that little face is like spooky looking. Yeah, giraffe rig. Well, here's a way for you to give back some oh. money. You wasted. I have been wasting money. I am not gonna lie. I don't like giraffe rig. Oh my god! Somebody drew Ooh. that. Uh. Yeah, you better. You need to stop before you really get some stuff. Get, no, I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> get, get the giraffe rig making out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna screenshot tail. that. We might put that. In the <laughs> yeah, send send it to people. Oh yeah, we're gonna put it in the group chat. Those those gophers make so much money. That should be my money, boy. They have to, they have to bury it in the ground. Thank God. They Why is there so much art that's just like that? Just that. No, what's with that? I don't like the demon. <laughs> I don't like it. Uh, they what is wrong? By planting yellow treasure bale flowers. Wherever you find treasure bales, take out your metal detector and star search. There's more! Just more! It's all like that! Like, uh. When the ring turns red, press A. You'll find the gopher treasure. The big old <laughs> red, green red button on your metal detector. Thanks, Ben. Even though you, God, you, really yeah. see, you just want to steal back the money that I spent fairly. Go ahead and have fun. Okay. Ben's have all these uh, rules, but when it comes uh, to stealing from people, he's like, yeah, dude. No. Grand Larson is Ben here. Uh, okay, I see you crying. What? Oh. But why, though? No. <laughs> Why, why did he need, feel the need to eat that? You know what? <laughs> you showing me all this stuff, but it's not good because no one else can see it. Just Google giraffe rig. Giraffe rig. <laughs> oh, so, all gosh. right. So people at home, I just found on Google images. I found a gif of the little face on the tail of the giraffe rig eating, and basically the giraffe rig eats with its butt, kind of thing. And it doesn't look happy. Or at least the butt head eats with its butt. Which yeah. Which is its mouth. Which is the... Yeah, it doesn't look... The giraffe rig's front half does not look happy about it. Because that it's a whole watermelon. I'll put some of that art. I, I, I screenshot of a couple of things. I'll, I'll try to put some of that in the episode. Actually, not be lazy this time. And actually do it. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> okay. Put a cap on that. Put a cap on what? On what you just said. Why? <laughs> Watch this episode back. <laughs> it's not on there. I'll be like, yep. You're going to be the one that edits it. <laughs> I'll do it. I just got to figure out how to work it. Anyways. Giraffe rig. I don't like giraffe rig. Giraffe rig makes me uncomfortable, especially all the art of it. Anyways, do you ever look up Sonic fan art just out of sick, like, morbid curiosity just to laugh at some uh, of the stuff people draw? Not recently. I have in the past. Like, not recently, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I guess I'll take, bust this. I'll tell you what. Right. Um, there is a, uh, there is an article on, uh, what was it, Polygon? On my bicycle, yeah. It was like Polygon or something. Like one, of them, one of them, oh, oh, you know, oh, oh. crappy gaming journalism sites. Um, That's right. Somebody wrote an article about Sonic at the uh, Tokyo Games, uh, one of the new sports in the game. Uh, like Sonic and Mario at the Olympic Games 2020. Uh, one of the new sports is surfing. Mm -hmm. And, you know, so, like, it shows everybody barefoot, except for Sonic. And this person is outraged that Sonic is not barefoot. I need them furry toes. Yeah, exactly. They're like, why Why isn't Sonic... They're, they're like, why won't they show... Wait, hold up. Like, literally, the article says... And the title of the article is like, they won't show Sonic's feet, the cowards. <laughs> like, you cowards won't show Sonic's feet. That's a, that sounds like, that's like a troll thing. Like, it's supposed to be fun. Like, it's not like a parody. I don't, I don't know. They did their research, too, is the scary part. So, of it. They, oh, they, they were like talking about. Read it. 
It's probably something that you've already done. Anyways, like it always has been. Anyway, so like they they talk about all the times Sonic's like had like his feet like out of his shoes like in comics or in cartoons, and they're like, but he's never had his shoes off in a video game. And me, me, me. I need them. I need to see the and wiggle animation on Sonic's toes. And they're like, oh my god! Like some of the uh, one of the <laughs> pictures from an official Sonic comic like looks really like weird and risque. Like, cause like it's him and I, I need, tails in I the bed. A, I need a okay. I need to ask this question though. What? So when you say everybody but Sonic, that means Sonic characters, or just specifically Sonic doesn't have his shoes off? Um, I don't know if like Tails has his shoes off, but they they showed a picture of Robotnik with his shoes off in gameplay. Well, I guess that's easier to draw. You know, he's just kind of human, quasi human, humanoid Eggman. But then like Polygon, like this report, like this. Gaming journalist, quote unquote, like is like pestering Sega or Nintendo or whoever um, has the rights at this point. Like I, I'm pretty sure it's just Sega still owns. I it. need to see the wrinkles in Sonic's Anyways, toes. Yeah, I want to see. I want to see. Souls. I want to watch Sonic mash mashed potatoes with his feet. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I'm glad that word ended up being mash. <laughs> you kind you you kind of stuttered on mash, so although it was about to be. Something without the H at the end, and then there'll be some other things after the S. <laughs> okay, okay, no, no. How about around the that's golf? No, that's not what I was talking about. Anyways, we all, I want to see the mashed potatoes between his toes and tails licking off. Okay. Anyways, now, now you're getting. Yeah, uh, that was too far. This, this video is getting flagged. What, what weird? Oh no, it has to be chili dogs. Chili? Oh, chili dogs. Yeah. Like it's just hot dog chili. And mustard uh, on his feet. <laughs> I want to see Sonic take a hot dog. I mean, a hot dog bun for each individual toe, put it around his toes, and then put chili on it and walk around. <laughs> That's what I need in my. I bet Sonic there's fan art of it. I bet there's fan art of that. I need that in my Sonic 2020 Olympics games. Yeah, I know. I bet there's fan art of it. So this person is like pestering like Sega about it and they're like they tweet at somebody wait and then the sonic official p fan page like retweets this article and says please stop asking to see our feet it's getting kind of creepy oh so this is sonic america i mean this is Sega america then yeah okay because if, if that was Sega japan it would be a different response no well response no no no, what are, no 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 what are the, no they they like ask one of the japanese developers uh -huh. and he says in canon sonic never takes off his shoes sonic in canon shoes are his feet I mean, that makes sense. I never... I mean, when you don't see Sonic take his shoes... Why? Why do you need him to take his shoes off? Because people are gross! Hell, hell also in canon, in at least one of them, they say his, his speed come from his shoes. And some of them... Some, some of them is like the ring on his wrist, like the Sonic Adventure games. Right. I don't know. What's the official reason for Sonic speeds? Let us know down in the comments. Well, you some, probably won't, but... In like the canon that. of the comics, he's a space alien. He's uh, not Earth. All right. I know. I mean, it's weird. I mean, I guess. Weird. Why would he be a hedgehog if he's an alien? Alien hedgehog. Why, why would it be a hedgehog still? He doesn't look like the hedgehog. Kinds why would they call him something else? The ball can't cross the fences, and the gophers can't go up the ramps. Uh. Lazy gophers, each new hole is a real puzzle. So do you reckon you're smart enough to beat the back nine? I reckon. <laughs> oh, yeah. On your death. You gotta beat the back nine. Death snuff. I beat the brakes off that back nine. For some reason, like, the back nine, like... something wrong with the back nine? I don't know. Like... Oh, press start to go to the back nine. Yeah, go to the back nine. Like, I, like you were talking about beating the brakes off it or hitting hitting it. I was like, I thought you were talking about, like, a headboard or something. was <laughs> the backboard or something. I don't know what I'm talking <laughs> Just for the record. <laughs> yeah. I'm oh, on yeah, many that, drugs. Yeah. <laughs> Let people know you're weird. Well, this is kind of interesting. I'll, I'll give it that. Oh, wait, what? But oh, you're going to get caught. 